stomping grounds my backyard this is from buckle down brewery out of leon's illinois also pronounced lions illinois this one's called hideout hazy ipa with blood orange it's a 6.0 abv new england style hazy ipa supposedly this is a collab with fuller house and pierce town tavern i went to fuller house's website I, this is not on tap there not sure what that whole thing's about but obviously it's brewed by buckle down brewing uh this is hop with citra el dorado and laurel uh they have a little description on their website a hazy hoppy tropical fruit bomb fruit bomb assortively hopped with citra el dorado and laurel against a rich backdrop of oats wheat and lactose finished off with a big dose of blood orange I've been there uh, a couple times. Uh, it's on uh, 47th Street. That's the industrial section of uh, Lions. It's in an old little, I don't know what, what was there before them, but uh, uh, not bad. Uh, you can usually find a seat if you go there. Uh, no food, but they do have a partnership with Paisans out of Brookfield, Illinois. Free delivery, any pie you want or anything from uh, Paisans in Brookfield there. Uh, let's go ahead and... Uh, Give this one a nose, shall we? All right, you can definitely smell that blood orange. Because they just legitimately added blood orange juice to this brew. I'm getting a lot of that. I'm getting a zing of citrus. Um, it sort of smells like a high C, if that makes any sense. That's what I'm getting. Okay, let's get a little PGN. A pour, a gander, and a nose. All right, it is hazy, but it, it's not that hazy. Let me get a, get a little Garcia swirl here, which is gonna give me a head. Nothing really floating around there. They must filter. Take a gander at that. It, it thickened up a little bit after that Garcia swirl. It was worth it. All right, let's get another nerves. Oh, dude, it smells like a high C. No joke. That's all I'm getting. Holy moly. It smells like a straight up orange high C. That is weird. Shall we? All right, mouth feels definitely smooth. The high C taste is there, but it's faint. And I really can't pick out those hops. Um, that blood orange is really coming through, which is pretty pleasant. Let's keep going. Oh, this is an easy drinker. 6.0. I wouldn't necessarily say they're hiding it well. Because it's there. You know, I've had some tenors where I, I couldn't even... Uh, pick it out but they're hiding it somewhat they're hiding out a little bit of a zing in the middle tongue to the back but not much can i bring this one to a juice bomb they brought it to a citrus bomb Or a fruit bomb. Pardon me. I'm going to say this is on the fence, but I can kick it over. Juice 
Alright. Hopefully whatever was living on the bottom. I don't I can't read the date on this one. Cause it's off kiltered. This is tasty, this is smooth. This is light. 6.0. The sweetness is staying pretty constant throughout this beer. Nothing's really changing. But again, um, the hops, I mean, they're hidden behind that blood orange. Hardly any bitterness. And I mean, it's citrus all day. Your your oranges. Your, I mean, obviously your blood orange. Um, I can't help to say that 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 high C familiarness is still there. This is a good one. I like this a lot. They have a different, a bunch of different types of this uh, hideout hazy. They have a dreamsicle version. They have a version with like mango and different fruits in it. I was not aware of that. Uh, I gotta follow these guys. Uh, they dropped another hazy to, or within the last week or so. There's only 25 people on um, Untapped. I don't remember what it was. I'll put up a little thing to sell you. Um, pretty stinking good. All right, I'm letting this run run long. Just to let you know, if you are in the area, they do have this membership or this club that you join. You get a bigger glass. Uh, it, co it costs less to fill that glass up if you go there and sit at the bar or belly up at the bar. You get first chance at any new drops. You get to go to these drop parties and stuff. And I believe it's only like, I don't know. I don't know if it's one-time membership. But it, it wasn't bad at all from what I remember the bartender explaining to me. Something you might want to check out if you go there. Ask about it. Maybe I'll throw that up too. Since I wasn't prepared for that one. But, I mean, this was quite delicious. It's in its own realm of a hazy IPA. Alright, I'm going to give this one, I liked it a lot, a 4.4 out of 5. This is delicious. Local small brewery on the, the my hometown, Leon's. All right, kick ass juice bomb, high C esque hop hops weren't really there, but still, I mean it's an IPA. I'm sure if you give somebody that hates IPAs, they'd say it's too hoppy. But for me, hops are hardly there. Good beer overall. Let's bring it back to the Parcells, and this song's called Hideout. <laughs> Beer review!